Okay, guys, let's start off standing situation. Um, let's go over a couple simple drills. So I always want situations that I have hands on him and he doesn't have hands on my head. Okay, this will enable me to start pulling him around, putting pressure on the head, etc., etc., making him higher and then getting into my, uh, getting into my attack. There's certainly a lot of good things you can do outside of the elbows. Okay, you can create angles, you can back exposure, etc. But when you're just starting off, it's a good habit to create to go in and take hands to the inside in a variety of different fashions. Okay, so we're going to start off in a situation very common where we both come out and we both take collar ties on each other. Okay, very often we end up in situations like this where we're ear to ear. First thing I do is I take my thumb over the top and I push away so that I get my forehead right next to his forehead. Now I just bring my hand to the inside, I take my knuckles inside of his uh, elbow and we circle away from that arm so that I can clear the hand off my head. Now from here we can start pulling him around, getting him into a square stance and going into our attacks. Alright, let's try it. Pull his head free, etc. There's good tension. And now the leg fires over with our knee nice and high. 
point, everything down to the floor, and now we're in a good position. Start going in, separating the hands, and controlling them. That'll be match finishing with an arm bar. the leg first. And now we come in and we take our left leg and get the same side of the arm that I want to attack and just start this pendulum motion. Rocking, rocking until I can get here. Now we lock everything above the head. So now my knee's over his head. When he goes to posture up from here, it's super tough. Okay, with all the weight of my uh, my legs hanging off of his head. And then now from here, we can start firing everything over or we get position, sit down on the floor. So whenever we go in, we attack with our arm. Okay, from the bottom position, we come out, we start locking up, we start firing everything over, and from here, maybe I fire the leg over, and you pull the arm free, we just grab a hold of this elbow. Okay, from this position, we keep everything nice and tight. We always back heel. I never want my feet just here, where you just pull straight out. We always back heel. That enables me to take my hips off the floor. And now my left leg swings around, and I take my knee right there behind this ear, and we pull everything in nice and tight. Now my hand comes out. Now I gotta go all the way to the opposite side. My head's on the wrong side. So we take our hips up and off the floor. And from here, we just take our hips squared in it. Now we focus on covering the shoulder. Now we focus on scooping the leg. We make the second adjustment that gets my tailbone pointed out to the side. Start taking our knees up and over, locking everything tight. We get a good triangle. Okay. Good job.